Hi, I'm Greg from Edge Nexus, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a load balancer in two minutes. So, this is the setup I want to set up. Um, I have at the top my virtual IP, uh, which is 192.168.252.201. So, this is the virtual IP address that represents my real servers, and underneath, I have three real web servers that I want to set up. So, this is the environment. So, first of all, I'm going to log into the load balancer. As you can see at the top, I've got virtual servers, and at the bottom, I've got real servers. So we're going to add the virtual server. So this is a service. And this example, uh, we want to set up a web service. So it's HTTP. So I'm going to enter the IP address of the new service. I'm going to select port 80 because it's HTTP, standard port. Hello world, just a name, don't have to put it in. And the service type, I'm going to choose HTTP. Update that. Now I'm going to add my real servers, the actual web servers themselves. So it comes to the next screen. Hit my IP address. Port 80, the same port, don't need to add anything else. Click on update. Um, and immediately the load balance has kicked in. It's realized that there's a, there's a route through, that the server's online. Everything's gone green to say that it's now brought up that service. So I'm going to add some more um, web servers. And I'm now going to visit this VIP to see that it's working. And hey presto, um, we've got some traffic coming through it. And you can see here, as I refresh, we're going to different servers. Each one of these images comes from a different place. And that's it. That is how to set up a load balancer in two minutes. Thank you.